Facebook is trying to delete me. Big Tech is trying to delete us, our movement. We must stop them. Okay, I'm already, I'm already, I'm, I, already, I, I already have so much I, to say. Already, I, I have already. so much to say. Yes. I Go ahead. Like, okay, even if you have a problem with big tech and stuff, maybe if you understand their motivations and all, and all maybe you would, it will help you fight back a bit better, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Facebook and big tech don't give a crap whether your movement succeeds or not okay yeah they are they don't care only the only thing they care about is how much they can get away with without getting in trouble for having you on their platform it's not their motivation to be like oh we don't appreciate this movement growing on our platform let's go again like do you do you agree with me susie like i don't do you think like facebook is like invested in seeing like this movement dying like look f big tech is trying to delete us our movement we must stop them like for example like I you know I say Republic the big tech is invested in supporting certain movements i think that's yeah, but obje like objectively true movements that like what for example um, like over the summer, there was a little button and sitting in the bat bottom of, I don't know if it's still here, but the, in the bottom of my Facebook, just calling it like amplify black voices in mm, support mm, of black mm. lives matter. Like they created okay. a whole feature to their mm -hmm. platform, right? which right, explicitly right. supported a specific movement. So they do yes, have yes. a vested interest in that. Right, right. I mean, that helps them with PR stuff as well, right? Yeah. But the negative side of it, I don't think is that. So even uh, the negatives, I mean, the negative. So it's not like they. Like you might have some Facebook employees, for example, that are emotionally invested in some movements growing and some movements dying. But the company as a whole is like is this a good pr move is this not a good pr move yeah um this movement having them on our platform i mean technically they wish i think if i had to guess right they're worried that if they kick too many conservatives off their platform it's going to be a great way for competitors to grow right i don't mm -hmm. think they want i don't think they want to kick their conservative kick so many people like this off of their platform <laughs> but i mean like conservative or platforms that have begun as kind of um in in uh reaction to conservative purges um have historically just flopped <laughs> so i, I know you really have to worry i no, i mean i know but if there is a chance i mean these are not like these are they don't want there to even be a chance. Do you know what I mean? Like creating, I mean, there's a reason why Twitter's shares dropped um, when when Trump got kicked off Twitter, right? Do you think Twitter likes that? I don't think they like that. I think they're like, they wish they would, they wish that they could just let everybody stay on their platform, but they also don't want to get so much negative press for letting these people on their platform. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So I don't think that they are like, ooh, we want to... So Big Tech, like, Big Tech is trying to delete us, our movement. Nah, I don't think they care. I don't no, think I they... like how she says delete as if she's <laughs> about to be shot in the head. <laughs> like, Ooh, no, be careful with that language sorry. on YouTube. <laughs> like, okay. that's... This mm. is not that severe. Yeah. Um he's way worse stakes i mean that doesn't mean that you shouldn't be concerned about so for example happening. when we get when we get a bit when we got like a violation report on facebook right for posting a meme that was making fun of um you, should, you know that viking guy that showed up at the uh, con and showed up in congress right mm -hmm. We got a like we got a violation report for that, right? Like we, our page we got a strike on Facebook, right? And it's obviously like what the hell? Like this this is not strike worthy, right? <laughs> like obviously, right? 
Um, we think like like I don't know the algorithm is yeah. misfiring, but we don't go ahead and be like, Facebook is trying to delete us. Our <laughs> movement, like we do, you f like we get so much crap from Facebook and we do complain about it. But do you imagine if we went out and said like, we think there's this agenda on Facebook against the atheist movement? Like no, like even even when Twitter like sus like I'm fully su suspended like on Twitter, like my account is gone, right? permanently right and my first assumption is like like you guys had to go out of your way to prove to me that there's some um hindutva crap going around behind the scene like you had to show me that there actually there is complaints hindutva is involved with twitter with facebook and that that there's actually legal paperwork that is uh, filed pressuring twitter and facebook to get my account removed, right? So we're gonna, um, and you know, the Time Washington Post has covered this. And now if you go on Facebook, on our Atheist Republic Facebook page in India, it actually gives you a red notification that your page is illegal in India. So I had to be, I had to get so much proof to should be like, okay, yes, there is some legit conspiracy. But I, my first assumption was like, I think this is just like people, the mob taking advantage of the algorithm, right? Like I didn't go full on conspiracy right from the beginning, yeah. right? So, but even then, I don't think like even now what that our Facebook page is now completely blocked in India, Atheist Republic's Facebook page because of government pressure. I don't think Facebook presumably. itself. I mean, presumably. I mean, if you go, what do you mean presumably? It, it gives you a notification that the page is illegal here. Yeah, that's that. That's why I'm making that presumption. Okay, okay. Like, but, but it's, that now we are pretty much proven. I mean, I'm still Almost. working behind the scenes to get even more evidence. More evidence. Okay, see, even now, even, <laughs> even now, we're like, we're not sure. This is how skeptical we are of everything, okay? <laughs> Done but, right. <laughs> Yes, but but we don't even now that we know that we almost know that the government that we are blocked in India because of pressures against Facebook. We don't think Facebook itself is like, yes, yay, atheist republic is bad. Like there's no motivation by Facebook itself. They're just like, oh my god, a legal thing from this court. Fine, we'll remove this page from India. We don't want to deal like it's easier. To just do that, like look at this. Look at who who is one who is who is on one side. The government of India. Who's on the other side? Armin and Susie. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Armin, and, Armin and Susie. The government of India. Which no, no, one of Armin? It's not just the government of India. It's the ruling party of India, which is the BJP, which is the world's largest mm -hmm. political party and right. the world's most well-funded political right, party. Right, right, right. And it's a far-right party. Right, right. So on one side... The two of us. <laughs> um, so Facebook is making a calculation here. I mean, right? Facebook is like, legally, who could cost me more and give me more headache? The largest political party in the entire planet... <laughs> Or Armin and Susie. <laughs> okay, but we're just getting started. To be fair, right. we're just right, getting right. started. <laughs> okay, we're, right. we're seven seconds into this video. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay, let's continue. Must stop them. Face, look at this. Facebook is trying to look at the production value, by the way. Oh, I was, we, I, I can't, no, I'm going to talk about the like, production value in a second. Can we have this, guys? Become a patron. Link in the descriptions. We have so that one day we can have a prediction value like this. Okay. When we can announce our legal things, the word taking the BJP to task, it needs to be this sexy. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. And also subscribe to our newsletter because if we get removed from all these uh, platforms, at least we could reach out to you. And guys, by the way, if you subscribe to our newsletter. You get a free copy. Uh, why there's not? Where's your copy, Susanna? Get it, get it, get it. We're doing promotion. 
You get a free, it's not even promotion, it's free. Okay, so if you subscribe to our newsletter, link in the description, you get a free copy of Why There's No God. Ah, come on, like I'm handing it out for free. Okay, it's a bestseller on Amazon and you get it for free. So subscribe to our newsletter and you get a free copy of Why There's No God sent to you. Link in the description.